Welcome back. In this next video, what we're going to do is we are going to take this toolpath and we're going to apply it down here. But how we're going to do that is going to be kind of cool. What I'm going to do is hold the control key down on my keyboard and just drag and drop that down to that face. When that happens, the software automatically finds the correct angular solution and creates the toolpath. I mean, that was easy, right? Let's drag and drop onto this face and see what happens. Here, now the software is going to check against the kinematic definition of the machine. It's going to find the angular solution, and it's going to create that toolpath. You know what? While we're here, let's rough out that pocket as well. I mean, why not? We have the end mill and the spindle. Let's do it. So now we have the pocket of that angular solution. And then next, let's take that toolpath, bring it over to this incline face. Cool. And then, of course, we're going to drag and drop it onto the next face as well. And really what I want you to pay attention to is the fact that I've just programmed five, six operations in a matter of a few seconds on a five-axis mill turn machine without worrying about anything. I mean, that's just awesome, isn't it?